Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Tori and this is going to be my fall 2023 decor haul. So I am going to start out with a couple of like everyday decor pieces. A couple, if you watch my videos, you may have already seen some things, but I wanted to kind of do all in one to show everything. That way, if anybody has any questions about where I got anything, um, this should include like all my fall decor or anything that is like everyday decor that I have purchased recently. Some, um, I think like, well, if you watch my shop with me videos, you've probably seen everything, but, uh, but I'm going to show you those really quick and I'm just going to start with like the everyday decor. So starting with these brass candle holders, I showed these in one of my recent decorating videos. These are from Hobby Lobby. I do believe the taller one was like $21.99 and this one was like $19.99 and then they were on sale. So 40% off. And I absolutely love these. I use them in my kitchen and they're absolutely beautiful. I love the colors. They match my style really well. And I feel like they'll work for any season. So that's why I love them. And that's why I got them for my decor. So next we have my lady. <laughs> if you've seen, um, again, my recent, I think it was the same video I used those. I had gotten this new lady and she was from TJ Maxx, only $14.99. I feel like that was such a good price because She's really heavy. It's almost hard to hold her up one handed, but the quality and the detail, and she is absolutely perfect for my everyday decor and my fall decor. So I love that. So next I have a couple of vases and they do already have some stems in them. Um, but here is the first vase and you can see it's like a brown color, but it's almost got kind of like an orange hint to it. It's like distressed. This was originally $14.99. I actually did purchase this one at full price because I loved it so much. And whenever I was shopping for like early fall decor and I stuck these stems in it, I was like, oh, I can't wait for it to go on sale. Um, so I did pay full price for that, but you can get this half off if you wait till their table decor is half off. And I do have another vase that I got that same day. So, so this is the other vase that I bought that same day. And this one was $11.99 and this one also was not on sale, but again, you can get it half off. I love the brown. I feel like it's perfect. These are going to be like kind of every day. They'll probably stay where they're at year round. Like this one's on my coffee table. That one's in the kitchen. They'll probably stay where they're at year round and I'll just switch out the little stems. It makes it so easy to decorate that way. So next for everyday decor, I have this little I call it a bowl, but it was in the candle section. So I do believe it is like a candle holder. And I just have these are mum stickers. <laughs> so these are from Hobby Lobby and they were $2.99 and then they were from the fall. So they were 40% off. And the little bowl was $12.99 and then I did get it 40% off. But I'm gonna take these out so you can see how beautiful it is. It's just so perfect for like everyday decorating. It's very like rustic and worn and that's just like the style that I'm really into right now. And I just popped like those mom stickers and then for Christmas I can put like some little jingle bells or just, it's just a perfect little piece to like fill in some space if I need some decor. So the next thing we have are these two and I'll take these stems out of them but I did buy these stems to go in them. They're just like, sorry if you hear Ginger growling in the background. She does not get along with her sisters at all. <laughs> And she's at the food bowl and they're trying to go to the food bowl too. So I'm sorry if you hear her in the background, but I'm going to take these stems out. <laughs> she's just a growling at them. I'm going to take the stems out so I can show you the detail on these. Aren't these absolutely beautiful? This is the vase and then I have the matching jug as well. Very rustic and like old world, like worn out. They just look vintage, but they're not actually vintage. They're from Hobby Lobby. This one was $21.99 and this one was $19.99, but I did get these half off. So I thought that was a really good deal. So this next one I had to stand up to show y'all because it's very large. <laughs> I have this base from Hobby Lobby and it is extremely heavy. Um, it's very heavy. I cannot hold it one hand, but I have to hold both hands. It was originally um, $94.99, but I did get it half off and you do see these stems, if you watch my shop with me video that I just did at Hobby Lobby, then you saw all these before. But these stems, I'll go ahead and do these real quick. Um, they were $5.99 each. They are so beautiful. Aren't they just so realistic? I love the colors. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have eight of them stuck in this large vase. And I feel like they fill it in pretty well. I haven't actually fluffed them yet. So I think definitely whenever, whenever I fluff them, they'll look really good. So that's that. 
the reason I wanted this vase was because I played with it in like a Christmas in July video at Hobby Lobby and I was like, oh my gosh, I want this vase. So now I have it and I can use it year round and just switch out my florals or my stems. So that's perfect. So I think the organization of this video is I just showed like my everyday type decor and then I don't think there's going to be much organization to the video other than I'll try to keep the new things towards the beginning of the video and then I'll do like the thrifted things towards like the middle of the video and then I think I'm going to show um because I did a huge purge and if you're like new to my channel or you're just curious about what survived the purge I was actually going to do a haul towards the end of this video that was like stuff that I have from last year because I probably had about seven or eight decor bins of fall decor and I'm down to I think two bins now and that is amazing because I just had so much that I never was I was never using it anymore because it just wasn't my style or I just you know wasn't feeling it so I did um, do a huge purge got rid of a lot of stuff so I think I'm gonna do um, pumpkins because I didn't get very many new pumpkins so as far as new pumpkins I did get this one and I absolutely love it I think it is so pretty I haven't really seen a lot of people talking about this one and I'm not so, I'm not sure why because I love it. I feel like it's so beautiful. It's $15.99. I really thought this was going to be a popular item, but I guess not. Maybe I'm the only one who loves it. <laughs> I really love it. I think it's beautiful and it matches like my distressed vase that I, I it used to be on my dining table and then I'm going to move it to my entryway table. So it's going to be my entryway table um, vase again. So it kind of matches that one. So I may try to put it in like the same area because I just think it's so pretty. It just looks so like high end and I love it. And next I have these pumpkins and these are also one of my favorites. So they were originally $11.99, but then they were on sale. So I got this one is like dark brown and it has a gold stem and I love it. I love the texture on it. I just love everything about it. And I also got the light brown color with the silver stem. I probably won't use these in the same area just because like they're I mean they're similar but like they're so different in color that I'll probably use one in like one area of my home and then use another one in another area because I just think that would look really good but I love these they're one of my favorites and I think I only have like two more pumpkins to show y'all I didn't go crazy with the pumpkins this year because I have a lot of pumpkins from last year so I think the only other ones are these I bought two of them of the same ones well once they're the same, but like one's kind of more orange and one's more red. Sorry, Violet's me. I went in the background. Um, cat mom life. <laughs> the girls are at school right now and I'm, you know, got a little break from them. I'm able to film, but now I got the cats going in the background. <laughs> um, these were $3.99 and they were from the fall shop. So they are on sale. Um, so they're 40% off, but I thought they're very lightweight and kind of cheap, but honestly, they don't look very cheap. Like to me, they look nice. And I thought they went with my color scheme and I was thinking that I don't want to go too crazy with buying lots of pumpkins because I have lots of pumpkins already from last year. And I just wanted a few just in case like I needed some extra ones and I thought I couldn't go wrong with these with how cheap they were. So picked up a couple of those. I guess I'll go ahead and show you all these little wooden spoons. Um, so here's an up close. Hopefully it focuses. If it's not focusing, I'm sorry, but they're just wooden spoons and they've got like leaves on the end and the leaves are red and gold. I also have the pumpkin version of these. They are from Hobby Lobby. They're originally $9.99, but they are on sale. So it ends up being like $6 right now for the pack of four. I just think these are so, so stinking cute. Like I love these. And I think I'm actually, I bought these for like the early fall decor, but I actually think I'm going to mix these with the pumpkin ones for like my like main fall decor we'll see but um i love these i think they're so cute so next i have this little pumpkin painting which i love i think it is like the cutest thing ever it was originally 5.49 i actually did pay full price for this one because i bought this back and i don't even know when they first put out fall decor which was it was a while ago a couple months ago <laughs> I bought this one and the apple one, which I'll show you next. Um, I have the apple and the pear, which the pear one I bought the other day. I did get that one on sale, but I thought this was so cute and I was a little bit, I had like FOMO, like fear of missing out. So I had to buy it whenever it wasn't on sale because I was like, I really want that. And they did, um, they did end up selling out of these at my store. So I'm glad I bought this. I did see one, um, wasn't recently. It was like, I think whenever I did like my first fall decor, that's ginger. <laughs> Violet just walked by and Ginger's like under the chair where I'm at. <laughs> um, but anyways, I, um, so yeah, I got this one and then the apples and pears. So I'll show you those really quick. 
So here are the apples and pears. Super cute. I love these. I also feel like these two, like, yes, they're very cute for fall, but they honestly could work year round for my hutch decor. So I was really excited about these because, you know, you can't go wrong with fruit and kitchen and dining room. So I thought these were really cute and they kind of have like that vintage feel that, you know, that, that like painting kind of, it's really trendy right now. I like to have art, you know, like painted art. I personally don't think I'll do a whole lot of like art prints or paintings throughout my house because I just love having like family pictures so i'm planning like a gallery wall and stuff we'll see i did buy frames so we'll see if i can get that done <laughs> um so i also have this other painting that i got for the kitchen so these will probably be used on the hutch the little paintings but i have this one that you've already seen if you watched like my early fall decorating i did already show this one isn't this beautiful it was in so it's from hobby lobby and it was in just their regular front decor section it wasn't in the fall section but to me these colors are just perfect for fall and it just it just warms up my kitchen for fall and makes it feel like really cozy in there but i'm really attracted to like art prints in the kitchen and the dining room i just think they look so good so i was really excited to find this and i just i'm obsessed with these colors i think they're so beautiful also it kind of inspired like whenever i saw these together um, I was like, these are perfect. Like they look like they're made for each other. I think they're just so perfect for each other. And I just love these stems, they're adorable. If I didn't already say, these are from Hobby Lobby and they were $2.99 each. I do have a lot of them. <laughs> I have more stems that I'll probably show those again because I'm gonna get into the stems. I'm, I feel like this video is gonna be a little disorganized but I'm just glad that I'm getting it done because I've been slacking lately with my YouTube. I've been really busy and I have like some kind of, if you follow me on Instagram, you already know, but I have some kind of like news that I'm going to share coming up. Um, but I was going to do it. I was going to do like a home office, decorate with me and then do my Q and A. Cause I've got lots of questions from Instagram and YouTube that I need to answer. And then, um, I was going to kind of announce my, it's not like a huge deal, but it's, it's very exciting for my family. So, um, I'll be doing that soon. Hopefully if I get around to it, that's kind of the reason I've been slacking cause I've been busy elsewhere so um so yeah let me continue on with this haul i get carried away so next i think i'll do candles because i think i'm like nearing the, i didn't buy a whole lot this year well in my opinion compared to what i've been known to do in the past um i'm nearing kind of the end like i think the rest of it's pretty much either thrifted or from last year or stems um this is uh okay i take that back i was gonna say this is the only candle but i did get two scented candles um, these are the only two candles I bought for fall. This one is like hot cocoa. Oh, it smells so good. It really smells like Christmas to me. It smells like fall and Christmas. This one was $7.99 and it was in the fall section. So it is on sale, but it is so pretty. Like that amber glass. I just think it's so, so adorable. I love the little bow. I don't know if you're supposed to keep the bow on it, but I thought the bow was cute and I'm planning on keeping this bow too. <laughs> I just thought the bow was cute. I feel like it I'm oh, sorry, I have to sneeze. <laughs> I feel like it just adds like a little touch, just a little extra touch. This one is buttery pumpkin. Oh, it smells so good. It smells so good. That is just like the best fall smell. Like I love Hobby Lobby buttery pumpkin smell. It smells so good. This one was $15.99 and I love how it's like a pumpkin shape. It is just the cutest little candle. And I was gonna get that like anthropology looking, like the anthropology dupe candle. I ended up not getting it because I wanted to, I've been trying to limit my spending. Um, Y'all be so proud of me. <laughs> but I, I had two buttery pumpkins candles in my car and, and initially I chose the one that was the cheapest because I loved them both equally. Honestly, I could have went with one or the other, but this one was cheaper. So I went with this one because I've been trying to limit my spending a little bit. Um, cause we've, you know, just got a lot of things going on over here. So, um, we're trying to save money and all the things. So we're trying to just like cut back and limit our spending. And I think we're doing a pretty good job. So, um, so on with the candles, I do have these taper candles. So, Oh, I have to tell y'all. So I have, these candles and these candles and i have some more uh, orange ones but i'll show them a little bit but if you watch like one of my recent videos where i had said that so uh, one of these was broken and then they overcharged me for these candles and i had that tray that was broken i ended up going back and they gave me like a refund for all the like mistakes and they were saying like they don't know how the heck the girl they don't know how she like got 12.99 from 7.99 but they refunded me the difference and then they let me return the broken candle and the broken tray and it was all resolved but, but I have these and I absolutely love them I hope they're picking up good on camera but they're like 
orange and they've got like leaves kind of etched into them. They're so pretty. And these were $6.99 and then they were on sale. So $6.99 each for the pack of two and then on sale for 40% off. I got these candles. These were kind of like my early fall color scheme. These were $7.99 also from Hobby Lobby. And I also have two, uh, so I have two of those and I also have two of these and they're like more of the like deep orange fall color so i'm going to use these for like my fall decor and these were also 7.99 um i think i'm going to do thrifted decor and then i'll do stems because i've got the thrift decor decor like right here and i'm excited to show it so i've already showed these but i got these at goodwill and i have just a little brass apple and it does have a wait it does have a bell on it <laughs> and I thought that was neat so I have this and then I have this leaf candle holder it's like a taper candle holder these were I think $4.99 each at Goodwill and I just thought they were so cute like this one especially the apple because I, I wanted to do apples for my early fall decorating and then the leaf uh, I just love it like I love brass so I just thought these were perfect for my fall decor so whenever I saw these I was so excited I grabbed them so fast I was like I gotta have these they're so cute okay next thrifted pumpkin how cute is this i know it's it's a little rough around the edges as in like i don't know if it's supposed to be like that but honestly i love it like i love the way it looks it was seven dollars but so for like a thrifted item i feel like that was a little pricey um like i would have expected to find it for maybe like five dollars but honestly if you look at like a lot of places online where they sell these they are way more expensive and even tj maxx this would have been at least minimum Probably $19.99, but I'm thinking minimum, it would have been like $16 or $14.99 minimum. So I got it more than half off of what it would have been. It honestly looks to me like it's from TJ Maxx, but isn't it so pretty? I just love it. And I love the like reddish color of it. I think it's absolutely beautiful. I could not believe I found this at the thrift store. I was like, who would get rid of this? It's so pretty. But I mean, I'm sure a lot of you think of, like the, about the stuff that I'm like, hey, I think I'm gonna get rid of this. Probably there's, I've had comments that people like on Instagram and they're like, oh no, I love that. Why are you getting rid of it? So I, I get it, um, but I love it. I feel like it's so cute. Um, so I do have a couple more thrifted things and then I'll get onto the stems. So next for thrifted items, I have this mix. It's like from, um, Goodwill, it was $3.99, but it was half off. I do remember that because I don't, I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have bought this for $4, but I think it was half off. It was a blue sticker day. And I really bought it because I wasn't sure. Um, I, so I really like this pumpkin, if you can see. And then I really like the like crocheted one. Not sure if I'm gonna use the other ones, but to me that was worth $2, like this one and this one. And whatever I don't use, I can donate back. Looks like there is some stems and stuff in here, but. So it's got like some sparkles to it and I'm not a big fall sparkly decorator. I've said this before that I love sparkles for Halloween and Christmas because to me Halloween and Christmas is just magical with like the sparkles. I don't know why. I guess it just feels nostalgic to me like when I was a kid. But as far as fall goes, I just like, um, I don't know, just non-sparkles <laughs> like matte and anything, you know, that's like burnt orange or like wood tones. Not so much the sparkles for fall, but uh, like I said, whatever I don't end up using, I could either donate back or see if any of my family members would use it. Um, but I really, really liked that crochet, crochet, I really liked the crochet pumpkin and then this pumpkin right here. And that to me, that was worth $2. So that's why, and there may be more down in there that I'm not seeing. But so the other thrifted thing that I have is this garland. They actually do still, it's like a six foot garland. They do still sell this at Hobby Lobby. And I believe, so this one had a tag on it. I think it still does. I paid $15 for it, but the tag like from Hobby Lobby says $49.99, but I believe this year it is $34.99. So, so I think it must've been more expensive last year. What is it? Does it say? It doesn't say what year. Sometimes it'll say like fall 2023 or whatever, but I don't know, $15. So. The one that's like right now, you can get it for $34.99 and then 40% off. So I still saved a little bit, but it, it had the tags on it. It was brand new. So um, I really love it. And I have an idea. I'll have to show y'all what I'm talking about, but I have an idea to like add some pics to it to kind of, cause it's kind of sparse a little bit, um, but I really like it. And I, I actually bought this and that other pumpkin at the same time. And I was just like, I'm hitting that rattan pumpkin. And I'm like, I'm just hitting the fall jackpot at this. It was at the same store. And um, so, the only other things I have that are thrifted are my throw pillows and blanket 
and I'll show those to you next. I do also, uh, real quick, I'll just show y'all this because it's going to go on the couch. I think I have two of these. I have one, another one somewhere, unless I gave my aunt a bunch of fall decor and I may have gave her one of these because I may have been like, well, I only need one. But this is from Ross last year, so I'm probably just going to use this. It's like boucle, and I think it was $8.99 at Ross last year. I don't know if they're, it's got like cat hair on it, but I don't know if they're going to have it again this year, but it was from Ross last year, and I love it. It's definitely like a dupe to those high-end ones from like Pottery Barn. And then the pillows and blankets, I was so excited about these. So I have, oh, let me grab those real quick. So here are the pillows that I thrifted, and I hope you can see them, but they're, they're pretty large. They're feather-filled, they're very soft. I love the color. They do have a few snags, but the other side's not snagged. And then they're very choppable. So, so I really love that. And I got two of them. You will not believe how much these were. They were $4 each at Goodwill. And they're like, like they're nice and they're clean and they didn't smell funny. <laughs> I am going to wash the covers, but I was like so excited when they got feathers coming out of them. But um, I can just tell that whoever donated these, like, you know, is clean. You know, you can tell like when <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know if you guys like thrift like I do, but I won't buy something if it looks like the per person didn't take care of it or it's just not, you know what I mean? So they look clean and they smell, they didn't smell funny. Um, I'm going to wash them, but I was really excited. And then look also at this blanket I found. So look at that. Doesn't that look so good? <laughs> they were actually at two, they were at two different Goodwills at two separate times, but they've got the same color scheme going on. Like the burnt orange, kind of like yellow white plaid and then there's also there's navy blue i don't know if it's picking up on camera but navy blue um but this was a dollar it was like a dollar 99 i think it was a blue sticker or whatever whatever color sticker day and it was a dollar i was like um yes i will take so i paid a total of less than ten dollars for all of this less less than ten dollars and I've already got my throw pillows and um, blankets on the couch that like I want to use every day. But then all I have to do is add these and that adds that cozy fall touch. Less than $10. I love thrifting. <laughs> I think that's it for my thrifted stuff. So let me start on the stems now. So again, I just wanted to show just in case whoever is like skipping through this video and wants to just see the stems. These again, they were $2.99 and I have a bunch of them. I bought, I think I have like five for that vase. So this is what they look like in this vase. Isn't that pretty? I just, I don't know, something about these. They're just so high end to me. They're high quality. If you know what kind of flowers these are or whatever they are, like, let me know because I love them. Like, are they fall specific or I love them, <laughs> but I just feel like they're such good quality. And I bought three for each of these, three for each of these for the hutch. Cause I'm going to see how that looks, but I wanted to just show those again, just in case somebody's just skipping through and just wants to see the stems. And then again, for my big vase, these are so pretty. These are so pretty. That just screams fall to me, like traditional, nostalgic. They're such good quality. They almost feel like kind of like velvety, um, but they're so beautiful. I hope it's picking up on camera. It probably is not even doing it justice. They're absolutely beautiful. These were $5.99 and then they were 40% off, but eventually I think fall will probably go half off eventually. Normally they do but I was just obsessed with these colors. It's perfect, absolutely perfect. So I have these red ones. Um, I don't remember how much these were, but I bought them in orange, so I'll show you the orange ones. But I have them, isn't that just adorable? And honestly, this probably could work for Christmas too, because it's got that red. Um, yeah, I probably will use this for Christmas, unless I end up doing like a like greenery, but these were so cute. I have them in orange, so let me check really quick. So here's the orange ones, and they are $3.99. Um, so beautiful. So they're basically the same as these, but I'm just going to swap, swap these out. So let's see real quick what they look like. You have to arrange them just right, but how cute is that? Isn't that adorable? So $3.99, I bought three of them. They're so cute for, I just love the idea of like taking a vase and like just leaving it year round and just swapping out little florals. That just makes it so, I told my husband, I said, um, whenever they start selling, cause I think I've seen other, maybe I got the idea from some, I really don't remember where I got the idea from, but, um, I've really, I've never been much of a stems and garland type decorator until recently. So I've accumulated quite a bit from like spring and summer and now fall and I will for Christmas too. And, um, I want to get one around Christmas when they have those Christmas tree bags. I want to get three of them, I think. 
um, maybe the smaller sized ones, three of them. So I want one for fall, like all my fall and like Halloween um, garlands and wreaths and stems. I can just toss them in there and zip them up and then get one for all my Christmas ones and one for all my, I'll probably do spring and summer together because they're a little bit interchangeable. Um, because they all kind of go together. Um, but I thought that would be a really good idea to keep all my stems, you know, because it's kind of hard to pack them down in those those decor bins. So then I could just have my decor in my bins and then have those like zip. I, I told him I, this is just my idea. I said, I think for my actual Christmas trees, I want to get those too. And I'll do red for, if they have red, I'll do red for the Christmas trees and then do green for the stems so that I know like these are my actual Christmas trees and these are my stems. And then I can either label them or just, you know, it won't take but two seconds just to unzip it and look and see what season it is. So I, that's an idea that I have um, for upcoming like storage, for decor storage. <laughs> Keeping on with the stems, I do have a handful of these. I love these colors. They're like very deep. It almost looks like eucalyptus, but it's like deep colors. I don't remember how much these were. I think they were like $2.99. They were pretty cheap. They might have been $1.99 and then 40% off. Um, and then I have these. I actually got these last year on clearance um, from the 70, it was either 75 or 90% off. I got a bunch of them, uh, but these are also from Hobby Lobby. Don't remember exactly how much they were, but if I had to guess, I would probably say $2.99 or $3.99. And I do have a couple more stems. I have like so many stems, it's crazy. <laughs> okay, so here's more. I'm only showing a couple of these because I have a bunch. These were $2.99 and I also have these in purple, so I'll show those next. And I got these for my little vase and I have some extra ones to fill in that garland that I was talking about just to kind of add some more color. These were $2.99 from Hobby Lobby, but I did get them on sale. They have little pine cones. They're kind of like eucalyptus. Um, so I'll show the purple ones really quick. So here is the purple ones and they are a little bit different. Um, they kind of got like a pointed shape to them, but I also got these from Hobby Lobby and I think they were about the same price as those other ones, but aren't these pretty? I just love for early fall doing like deep colors and like deep warm like purples and maroons and reds and then you know as the season goes on kind of adding in those like oranges and pumpkins i just think that's really pretty so i will show i have a couple more things i'm sorry if this like haul is all over the place i feel like my hauls tend to be kind of like all over the place but a couple more um florals to show and then i think we'll be done with my new stuff <laughs> Here's the wreath that I had on my fireplace um, for early fall. And I don't I don't remember exactly how much it was, but it was from Hobby Lobby. And it, it, I love how it kind of like hangs down if you watch like my early fall decorate and I really love these colors. And I wish I could remember how much it was. Um, it was probably, it was probably like $29.99 or so. And then it was 40% off if I had to guess. But I wanted to show that um, just in case anybody was wondering where I got it from. So I do have a couple of wreaths. Um, this was like my early fall decor and this one is, I think this one was $12.99 and then 40% off. And then this one was $9.99 and then it was also 40% off. But I really love these colors for like more, getting more into like the cozy fall season. And uh, a couple more stems and then I'll get into like my stuff from last year that made the cut, made the purge cut. <laughs> so here I just, kept it in this vase because um, they were like kind of hard to arrange. <laughs> but these were also from Hobby Lobby and I think they were like $3.99 or maybe $4.99. Um, they were not very expensive, but I really love these. I love the, the ones I found for my big vase. I love those a lot more because they're more realistic looking. These are, I mean, kind of like they're pretty from far away, but I feel like up close they're pretty cheap looking. Like they probably won't pick up on camera, but they are still really pretty and I love the colors. So I think I'm gonna use these in my entryway. And then I have those deep purple ones, which I'm gonna show you in just a second. Those are the ones that were in my entryway for early fall. So last but not least, these are my, um, these are my stems that I use for early fall in my entryway table. And I'm also, I think, gonna use these for Halloween because to me, they just look Halloween-y. These actually were from Hobby Lobby, but they were in the regular stem section, not in the fall stem section. I really love them. I don't remember exactly how much they were, but I think I think they were $11.99 and then they were 40% off because florals are maybe half off. I think florals were 40% off, either 40 or 50% off, but um, I really love them for early fall and also Halloween. I think they're perfect for Halloween because they've kind of got like, they almost look black and then they've got purple, which to me, I associate those with like spooky Halloween colors. 
um, and then like orange, I associate more with like fall. Um, but that's it for my new 2023 fall decor. Um, actually, let me show you. So I have this little dough bowl and I'm going to show you that real quick. Um, that's like the last thing that I think was new this year that I haven't showed yet. So I do have this little dough bowl and I filled it full. All of the little pine cones and acorns are from Hobby Lobby. It was like a mix, a bag mix of them for $4.99. And the dough bowl is from a local consignment shop. I have a handful of dough bowls like this from her shop that I love. And I just think they're perfect for decorating because I can just like, again, like take these out and put like greenery or jingle bells or whatever for, or Christmas ornaments for Christmas, but I love decorating with stuff like this, but I wanted to show y'all because I, I just glanced over there and I was like, oh, I haven't showed the acorns and the pine cones, but that is it for my new decor. So now I'm going to whip out my last year's decor and show that to y'all really quick. So really quick towards the end of this video, I'm just going to show y'all everything that I have from previous years. Um, some of this I've had for a couple years, some of it I got last year, and I actually pulled out my bins and there are those like 18 gallon totes, and one of them actually is mostly Thanksgiving, and I have these wreaths stuck on top. Um, there was just like one pumpkin in there that I'm gonna show y'all. So really, I mean, other than Thanksgiving, I really only have like one 18 gallon tote full of fall decor from last year. Um, but the first thing from last year is this stem. I really, um, this is from Target, from the um, Hearth and Hand line. And I really wish I would've got a couple more of these. I don't know why I only got one. I guess because it's so big, maybe, I think it was kind of expensive too, like $9, which really that's not that expensive. But I think to me last year it was kind of expensive, but I got one and I kind of wish I would've got at least two or maybe three, cause I feel like it would've been a lot prettier. Um, but if they come out with them again, I'll probably pick up some more because I feel like this is something I would use for a few years. That's why I'm like really wishing I had got more cause it's really pretty. And I feel like I could've used it for a couple years or forever probably cause I mean, you know, some brown leaves. That's pretty like timeless for fall. Um, so that was the first thing. And then next I have this wreath, um, which is one of my favorite things ever still. I think this will be my third year using this. Third, third or fourth? I think third year. It's been a couple years. I got it on clearance at Kirkland's and it's like purple eucalyptus and I have the little matching mini wreaths, which I probably keep this forever because I love it. And um, like even if I don't use it in my kitchen above the cabinets like I normally do, I can use it on the front door. There's so many uses for it. So I really love it for fall. I could have used this for my early fall decor as well because it goes with that color scheme. But I also have these little like, I have these like mini wreaths that kind of match that uh, also from Kirkland's. I got on clearance a few years ago, same time I got that one. One of them is missing the like one of the rattan pumpkins this one has three and this one has two this one's about to only have two this one's like hanging on by a thread <laughs> um but i thought these were really cute too um and these honestly could be early fall but they had the little pumpkins so i like waited maybe to put these out like for like fall fall i think i might put these on my little bar stools this year i'm not sure but they have these little hooks on the back that would be perfect for that so we'll see so next I have this. This definitely is one of probably arguably my favorite piece of fall decor. Definitely my favorite from last year. Um, I got it last year at TJ Maxx. It was $14.99 and it's like a wood grain. I do believe they still have this this year. I've seen it in some other people's videos when they've been out shopping. It's kind of like wood grain. Um, it's not wood. It's like kind of like ceramic almost. Not ceramic. I don't know. Like plastic ceramic kind of. <laughs> I don't know what kind of material, but you know what I mean. Like it's, it's not wood and it looks kind of like wood grain, but I really love, like it's so neutral and I love it. I feel like it's going to be pretty like forever. I'll probably love it forever because it's just so like neutral and it'll go with everything. So next I have this glass bowl pumpkin, which needs washing. Um, it's kind of dusty, but I got this was actually, I saw these on Pinterest and uh, I actually got this one from TJ Maxx and I don't remember how much it was. I think it was like $6.99 or $5.99. It was very cheap. And it was full of cotton balls. But whenever I saw it, I was like, that would be so cute to put coffee pods in. Because I seen that on Pinterest and I thought it was a really good idea. And I really love it. I actually did have the one from Target. And I think I ended up parting with that one. Because I was like, I don't really need two of them. So I kept this one because I like the shape of it better than the one from Target. So next I have my little pumpkin spoons. I've had these for a few years. And if you can see, they've got like the, they're like the leaf ones, but they got little pumpkins on them. And honestly, I mean, they look okay. I've had these for a few years. They've seen better days. They're starting to look a little rough, 
but I may like whenever if these survive if they go like 75% off because I did see them at my Hobby Lobby again this year and if they survive to the 75% off I may pick up another set because I don't really need it but um, these like I said they're looking kind of rough like I you probably can't tell it probably won't pick up but they're looking kind of dingy because we actually do use them um we like put them to we stir like use them to put sugar and stir our creamer and then we wash them so they 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 get used <laughs> so that's probably why they're looking a little rough but i think they're just so cute especially like with these leaf ones like how cute is it gonna be to like well like mix you know whenever i get them all arranged and like mixed up in the little i have a little holder that i put them in they're so cute i do have a couple of these garlands these are from target last year I don't think I'm going to use these just this year. I don't have a plan for them, but we'll see. Um, I actually told my husband that I may part with these because I don't have a plan for them. Um, but then I'm kind of like, what if I want to use them again in the future? Like, they're really pretty. I love the colors. But we'll see. I don't know if I'll end up keeping these this year. But I, this is two of them, like, kind of wrapped up together. They are kind of, like, they're okay. I think they were $20 each. I don't think they have them again this year or they haven't put them out yet if they do. But, um... I like them. I'm not sure if I'll get rid of them, but I'm trying not to like hold on to things that I don't use, if that makes sense, but we'll see. So in this Target bag, I have a mix of these white pumpkins from Hobby Lobby. They do still have these. I think I have two packs, maybe. I think I have two packs and it like fills up this Target bag and they're just a mix of all different like sizes of these white pumpkins. And these are from Hobby Lobby and they do still have these. They have them in like white and these are the white ones, I believe. And they have like an off-white and they have orange. So I have these, which are perfect for like filling dough bowls or like vases or whatever. I think these are perfect. So I mentioned that I had a bunch of these and <laughs> I really have a bunch of them. So I bought one, um, like I think it was 40% off last year and it was, so it was originally $17.99 and then I don't know how much they are this year, but $17.99 last year. And then I got it 40% off. I bought one, probably not this one cause I used it. So it's one of these, but then when I went back, they had them 75% off. So I bought a couple more. So I have, um, I think like three packs here. So these will be absolutely perfect for filling like my big dough bowl. I think that's what I'm going to use them for. I just love them. I love the texture on them. And the different colors like we have the light colored one and it's like textured rattan and then we have like a brown one also so pretty i feel like these are perfect for my dough bowl i'm probably not gonna i could barely fit them in this bag i'm probably not gonna be able to get them back in here and then we have the orange ones so these are from Hobby Lobby and they do still have them this year. I love them. They'll probably keep bringing them back because they're so popular so i also have this bag full of pumpkins and i think I think that one, I don't know, that one might belong with the Hobby Lobby ones, but these are from Target last year. They were from the dollar spot, and I think it was like $3 or maybe, yeah, I think it was $3 for like a mix of them, and I got a couple, and I actually think that there's more around the house because the cats had like played with them like crazy, and they like batted them, you know, like use their little paws and like batted them under things. <laughs> we probably have so many of these just in random like hidden places around the house. Cause I found some like under our entertainment center when we when we sold that and then I found some in my office so I'm gonna have to gather up all these <laughs> I have so many of these but I think these are all these are also perfect for like dough bowls and just you know base filler so I really like these I'll probably hang on to these probably forever because they're just perfect for that okay next from Target I have these rattan pumpkins from last year I believe the bigger one was 10 and this one was five if I'm not mistaken I really love these. I love, I still love these this year. I feel like they're perfect. They add that texture and they look really high end. So I'm really glad I hung on to these. Um, I feel like everything, it was either a definite yes or like a definite no for, for the most part. A lot of the stuff I got rid of was like really, really farmhousey. Like my, like I used to do really farmhouse like trucks and galvanized and um, Buffalo check. I used to be really into that. So that was a lot of my fall decor that I ended up parting with. But lucky for me, a lot of people still love that style. And to me, it's just like, it's nostalgic now to look at it. Like whenever I go to Hobby Lobby and I see it, I'm like, oh, because that's how I used to decorate my house. Like for, for fall, and I actually used to have like, I used to have the Buffalo check, like curtains and rug and like a bin with our shoes in it. Well, back when we lived in our trailer that we lived in before this house. But um, yeah, these are super cute. <laughs> okay, next, another Target bag full of, I believe these are like little, 
woven or little yeah these little pumpkins i have a bag full of these i love these i think they're so cute i got them last year at tj maxx i believe and i think it was like 7.99 or 9.99 for the whole bag of them and then these are going to be perfect for a dough bowl i think i'm going to use these on because i have a bunch of them so i'm thinking for these i'm going to use them on my little i have like a textured white bowl in my entryway table and i think i'm going to put some in that bowl and then i'm going to put some i think on the hutch dough bowl but we'll see i think they're so cute and perfect for that so next i have these and i have three of them so i'm just going to bring out the one but i think i'm going to use these in the girls room they're perfect for like a little girls room because they're just white and they're dimply and they've got gold if i do need to use them like if i need more pumpkins <laughs> this is why I, like back when i was saying earlier like i didn't go crazy with the pumpkins this year because i have a lot of pumpkins um i have a lot and i got rid of a lot so it's like crazy how many i still have but I think these are perfect for the girls room because they're a little more like a little more whimsical they're kind of sparkly and bright and i think the girls would love these and if i didn't mention i think these were tj maxx last year i want to say it was like 10 bucks for the set of three if i'm not mistaken either ross or tj maxx i want to say tj maxx though i do have two of these that's another thing that i'm different like with my old way of decorating and my new way of decorating is that i used to always buy two of everything i don't know if it comes from having twins and like always wanting to buy two of everything i don't think that's what it is but i used to always buy two of everything if i find a piece of decor i like i'm buying two of them i don't know why i used to do that like that's something i think a lot of it came from, I used to decorate very symmetrical, so I felt the need to like put one on each side, if that makes sense, um, to make everything look really symmetrical. But I think as my style has like evolved, I've gotten better at like balancing colors and textures and sizes and all the things. So I've gotten to where I don't have to do like one of each on each side to make things look balanced. These were, these were a few, so fall 2021, $21.99, but these were $75 or $90, something like that. I got them on sale, um, so I definitely didn't pay $21.99, but I have two of them, and I love them. They're like amber glass, and they're dimply. I think they have these still. I can't remember if I saw these, but I think, I think they might still have these. If not, they've got some that are similar, because I do remember seeing them recently. So next, I have these pumpkins, and I ended up keeping these because I love them. I still love them this year. I have a gray one and a white one. TJ Maxx, $5.99 each last year. I think, I want to say these were like one of the first pieces of fall decor I found last year. And I was so excited because we had just moved back to our house. I was ready to start decorating. I didn't have any new fall decor from, I think, 2021. I had just started my YouTube channel and I think I was going through like a job change and like we just didn't really have the money. So I didn't buy any new fall decor. So last year I went a little crazy and I bought lots of new fall decor and um, I, this was like one of my first fall finds. I was so excited because we had just moved back. I hadn't bought fall, bought fall decor in like a long time so I, I went kind of crazy with these. I do remember being really excited and I still really love them. I love the texture. I love how they're dimply and I love how I have a gray one and a white one. So I'll probably use these in like two different places of my house because they're like the same but at least they're different colors. <laughs> but um, yeah, I really love these. So here was another, I think TJ Maxx, yeah, TJ Maxx, $7.99. This was another thing that I remember, it's really dusty. It's crazy how it gets so dusty just in one year. But I found this was another one of my first fall finds last year. And um, it's kind of, it's hard to tell what color it is, but like some light, it looks black, some it looks amber, some it looks purple almost. Like right now it looks kind of amber purple, if that makes sense. It's like kind of like an ambery purple color. Um, and then it's got like the gold sparkly, glass like spun on there i do have a larger like version of this that i'm going to show next but i really love this i was excited to find this and here is that larger version oh my gosh y'all how pretty would this be for the girls room y'all haven't seen their room yet but it's like really girly and feminine and kind of vintage like pink floral wallpaper pink walls they got a new bed like all the things this would be really pretty for their room because it's like clear and it's gold and it's just really feminine this was from tj maxx 12.99 last year um now do you see why i didn't buy a whole lot of pumpkins this year because i have so many pumpkins and i still have one more to show y'all and then a couple that i didn't show because i have multiples so i showed you like one and i have more i have so many pumpkins like it's it's insane not nearly as many as i used to but a lot still so here's my last item i think definitely my last pumpkin because it's all I see down here but this is from Target last year three dollars 
they did have more like sizes and shapes of these but this was the only one i found i wish i could have found more of these because i really love this pumpkin i really love this color it just reminds me of those like pottery barn ones that were really popular last year um and i love it i wish i could have found more of them but i think that is it i'm not going to show the thanksgiving stuff because i'll probably i'll probably do like a thanksgiving shop haul cook decorate whatever when we get closer like a couple weeks before thanksgiving i'll probably do or maybe like i think i usually do it the week before thanksgiving to get everybody kind of excited for thanksgiving but that other bin is mostly just thanksgiving it's got like some turkeys and some turkey salt and pepper shakers and a cornucopia and like it's all thanksgiving themed stuff so i only really had one bin full of fall stuff that i kept versus i think i had seven or eight bins Full of fall stuff which is crazy so now i think i'm gonna be i think i need at least one more for my new stuff but um at least one more yeah because it's mostly florals and garlands which is what i'm like i love to decorate with like florals and stems and garlands now so it just makes it a lot easier and honestly more affordable because stems are not that expensive but yeah i think that's gonna wrap up this haul i'm going to try to start decorating the kitchen and dining room today while i've already got my hair and my makeup and my fall sweater on i think i'm going to do that after i get done filming this i may take a little break and get something to eat and then film that so this will probably go up soon and then that one will probably go up i'm supposed to be collabing with another youtuber so i'm going to get with her and see when she wants to do that and then that'll be going up soon as well so whenever you're seeing this hopefully within the next couple of days my fall video will be going live or at least my part one um so i hope you guys enjoyed and if you're not already i hope you will subscribe and like this video and comment and let me know what you think and if you're excited if you've already decorated if you're excited to decorate just let me know and thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed.